Hello everybody, Lurks here, welcome to my channel and today it's the Bosch Siri 4 Vario Perfect washing machine, the super wash. This is where you can do a wash of 30 minutes or 15 minutes. Maybe you're going to a ball and your special bit of clothing which you thought was clean is dirty and you need to wear it. You can chuck it in for 15 minutes, give it a wash, chuck it in the tumble dryer and off you go to the ball. Everybody deserves to be taken to a ball. I'm going to film this in real time, so let's see if it really is 15 minutes and whether the wash is any good. This is the Bosch Vario Perfect Series 4 washing machine here, and if you're interested in buying one of these, it's definitely worth checking out a review of this, which I did, and there's a link above now. Right, let's go round and select the super quick 15 minutes or 30 minutes washing program. And it defaults to 30 minutes. Now to get it to 15 minutes, what you do is you just press this speed slash eco button. And that then sets it to a 15 minutes. Right, let's get my clothes in. All I've got is a fleecy top and a pair of tracksuit bottoms. So it's a small wash and it's a super quick wash. Let's close the door. Now I'm just going to put a small amount of liquid detergent in. I won't need much in here. And actually while I'm showing you this dispenser drawer, there's a link above now about what goes in what compartment in this specific washing machine. Because I'm always forgetting what goes in what compartment. Right, I think that's enough. So let's close this detergent drawer. I think we're ready to start. Let's push that start button. Right, and off we go. And I'm going to set my stopwatch. Now I'm just going to put the child lock on and there's a link above now about how to put the child lock on, on this Bosch washing machine. And as you can see, we've got the padlock icon, so the child lock is now on. And let's go. Now I can just hear it taking the liquid detergent from the dispenser drawer. And there's a link above now about what to do if your washing machine is not draining water. And now it's doing its main wash. Obviously, this is a very, very shortened version of a main wash. As I mentioned at the beginning of the video, I'm filming this in real time. So there's no editing, no cuts, nothing. So this is exactly as it is from start to finish. The washing machine is now saying we've got 13 minutes left. Is it time to put the kettle on? Ooh, maybe a bit too early. But I will be having a nice cup of tea at the end.
And now we're on to the rinse cycle. And you can tell that because if you look at the status on the front of the dashboard, the rinse symbol is lit. And we've got nine minutes left.
And now we're down to 007 minutes, 007. Yes, quail shags, the name's Bond, James Bond. Quail shags, lovely party, pity I wasn't invited. Four minutes left and the start of the final spin as you can see the status has changed on the front of the dashboard there and I left the spin speed as it was so it's going to be 800 rpm. And now we are down to three minutes left. So I've just got time probably to boil an egg. Well, it'd be a runny egg, but I think I've just got time to do that. Right, where's the eggs? Over here. Have I got time to do that? Or oh, I don't know. I don't think I have. No, I haven't got time. No, put it back. Let's just have a nice cup of tea instead. This is all in real time still. Three minutes left.
And now we've got one minute left and we're doing a final spin. And as you can see on this washing machine, it is very smooth. Apparently it's got magnets instead of brushes on the drum, which is why it's so smooth. It hardly moves about at all, as long as you've got it on a level surface. Ta-da! And there we go. That is the end. And I've just stopped my stopwatch and I made that 17 minutes and 13 seconds. So a little bit of a line, not exactly 15 minutes, but pretty close. So I'm going to turn the child lock off and then turn the machine off and then open the door. And there's a... Oh, hold on. Let's get the kettle on first. Silly me. And there's a link above now about what to do if your door is stuck on this washing machine and you cannot get it open. There's a fix for this so you can get the door open. Right, let's empty my clothes. As I mentioned earlier, it's just a fleecy top and a pair of tracksuit bottoms. And they smell pretty good and look pretty clean. Let's go and hang them up to dry. These were just left on the normal settings and it was an 800 revs per minute spin, but they're not too wet. So we can just go and hang these up. And these are smelling very fresh indeed. All fresh and clean, hanging up to dry. And now I can go to the ball in my tracksuit bottoms. But I'm not going anywhere without a cup of tea first. If you found that video useful, please subscribe by pressing this button down here so you don't miss more videos on how to save you time and money. There's also some other videos around the edges of the screen here. If any of those are useful to you, then you can select those now. Thank you for visiting my channel, everyone. I really, really appreciate it.